So this is this week's Dollar Tree haul. I had gone to the garage sales today and I have some other work to do and I had a few things that I wanted to work on but my son's um, girlfriend Cassie is doing clay and different things so she had asked me if I would pick up a few things for her. So of course how can you just pick up a few things and not pick up something for yourself. So I am going to try a few different things that I saw and the last time I went to Dollar Tree I wasn't quite sure how these were and I really ran out of coffee. So they now selling um, the K-Cups and I'm not into saving the K-Cups but I might start saving them for little projects that I know you can do with the plastic containers um, and of course you can recycle these so it's just cleaning them out and stuff like that but I did want to try these so I got a pack to try these and they also had some other treats that I was like surprised to see I want to try these um, the frozen bananas I did have them before and they were pretty good so I want to try these again and they have the ice eclairs. I try to behave like all the time, but when I want a treat, these are perfect. Like you can eat one or two and then still kind of watch what you're eating. And then they have these. Like, are these not like, come on, they look delicious. So um, for a dollar, I figured I'm gonna give them a try. And I guess you just microwave them. So I'm gonna try these. So I got those. And I got this, hi Lulu. I got, how cute are these? Now, I don't really know anybody right now, but I figured I might do some kind of little display at the store with my little fairy dolls or something um, to sell them. But there are these um, kids, little doll houses. And really, if you were really crafty, you can get some heavy cardboard and like a cardboard box and you can glue this and trace it and cut it out. And they have like different ones that you can do, house kits. So I got that. And Cassie wanted, look at Lulu's looking for her treat. So my dog loves these. And I know people are going to say, don't give your dog these, blah, blah, blah. You know what? My dog's been eating human food forever. Everybody's like, don't do that. And they say the treats are going to kill them and blah, blah, blah. We all have our time on earth. My dog's getting this. She loves them and I'm going to give her one. So um, everybody has their opinion on snacks and stuff. So I'm just going to give it to her because she wants it. So... Um, and then how can you have a doll house without a cute doll to go in it? I mean, come on, is she not cute? So I don't know what I'm going to do yet. I have a little display at the store, so, and I just got that kid's table, so maybe I'll add some little toys for the kids to play with. And then last week I showed you that they have these really great, um, mats that, um, are in black. But today, I found them in red and green, too. So these are perfect if you're a teacher. They're only a dollar. And like I said, my son's girlfriend, Cassie, is um, doing clay. So she wants these so she can roll out her um, clay and make her little items. So she's even going to do a tutorial with me with um, um, using the cords and stuff from Dollar Tree. And she makes the most adorable charms. Then I saw these because you don't always have citronella, but I thought I'm going to try these. They're citronella incense for the mosquitoes, and they're really nice and long, and I'm not sure you get six in here, but they're pretty big, so I would think you'd have a few times to be able to use these outside. And I haven't made these yet, but I've seen people using these placemats for journals, so I'm going to try it, so I figured I could fold it here where the two come in so then you'd have him on the front you know and vice versa one on the front one on the back so I got these because I wanted to try that and then this one would even make a cute journal so you could poke your holes here here and here and you could put paper in here and you can use those rings from Dollar Tree and this would be a really cute journal cover too and they have these for journals so I thought that these were cute to put inside the journal covers and you'd have a little coloring doodle for there and I couldn't resist these cute towels. How cute are these? Look at the colors, how pretty they are. So those are really cute for summer. And I figured I would get her, since she does the small clay, I got her these small, um, these little nail kits because you can use these for more than just your nails. So I got her two of these so that she can work with those. And of course I got Lulu a little toy, but I made sure that there's no eyes in it because that's the first thing she goes for, the eyes. And she chews the eyes out. And then I got, oh, I don't know what I'm going to do with these yet, but I thought they were kind of cool. And they're just jumbo tweezers. You know what I mean? Like if you need to pick something up and you don't want to use your fingers, but they're jumbo tweezers. 
so it might be good like if something's a little wet and you don't want to get it on your fingers i don't know um, now i'm going to use it someday for something but they're in the um kids section with all the school supplies and stuff but they're jumbo tweezers and I got Cassie these because she said she needed small containers to store her stuff. So I got her a few of these. And last week I showed you how to make the purses out of placemats. And somebody went to Dollar Tree and they made a purse out of this one. So she kind of did the same thing. She folded it up and she glued the two sides. And then she made the flap here. So this actually makes a really cute purse too. So you can do the round ones as well as the other ones. Then... Because it's summer and everybody's tracking in different dirt and stuff, how cute are these rugs? They're like cute for the door, they're cute for by the pool, and these are easy to throw in the wash, and they have really cute colors. So I got a couple of those. And let's see what I got. Now these, you're going to want to get a few of these, especially if you start doing the bigger journals where you need a hole punch. They sell these at Dollar Tree. Now you can probably only put like two or three pieces of paper in there to um, you know put your hole in but you guys know how to work this right you just open this up and you see the holes the little punch here so you line your paper up and what's nice about this is it has this edge here so you put your paper on the edge here the bottom and then you just snap them so that all of them have the same hole so it lines up evenly when you put um, your journal together so I got those and then if you do start doing um, any type of jewelry with jump rings or anything, needle nose pliers are great. And they finally had them at Dollar Tree for a dollar a piece. So I had to get a couple of these, and Cassie said she needed a few more of these too. So I got her a few of these. And let's see what else I got. I got a jump rope because I'm going to make something out of this jump rope. I'm going to make something and I'm going to share it with you guys. And let's see what else I got. Oh! Look at these cute cosmetic bags they have now. I'm going to give this to Cassie, too. I just thought they're, they're really cute. I mean, come on, for a dollar? And they're perfect for, like, the summer. And it's got, like, a nice soft lining inside. And it's got a zipper on it. One says gorgeous and one says killing it. How cute are these? And they're in the cosmetic section. And then I thought these towels were really cute. Really cute. So I got a couple of these. They're the Sailor. And... They had a couple of real pretty scarves. So I picked up these because I was trying to think of something fun that I could make with these. So I'm going to come up with something creative and I'm going to share it with all of you. So that was my haul for this week. So I'm going to tell you how these are because I'm going to put them in the freezer. But I think I'm going to try a few because these look really, really good. And then the eclairs. I mean, I don't think you can go wrong on these. And everybody says, you know what? Um, you have to watch certain Dollar Tree items. You have to watch certain items anywhere you shop because a lot of the stuff comes from the same source. It's just a different name. So um, I'm going to try these when I start my diet tomorrow. So that was my haul for this week. And um, check it out this week. I have a few things that I'm going to be posting. Um, I'm going to be making the... Um, I get a yay and a nay on my... Um, wreath my stork wreath and my son said mom it needs a wing so I'm gonna put a wing on there just to make it look like it's flying and then I have a couple of other wreaths and I have something really fun that I'm gonna post tomorrow night just to start off your Monday so make sure to check it out and I wanted to say thank you to all of you that have been commenting and that have been following me and I almost have my channel ready so you guys will be able to see um, all the videos in one place you can just subscribe and when you need help you can just go to the video and you can check it out and I hope so some of you guys are going to like put these things together and give them away as gifts and even start to sell them. So good luck to you and I will see you soon.